We can all agree that a good hunting dog is a lot of help in the duck blind and can be your best hunting partner. We got some tips from one of the best trainers at Honey Break in Jonesville, Louisiana. Here at Honey Break, we all about the ducks, dogs, and decoys. So every day our mind's on ducks getting ready for duck season and to do that you got to keep your dogs well tuned and well trained and to do that you need uh, technical ponds and good areas to run your dogs and it needs to be a repetition somewhere you can go do it every day. It don't take a lot of time but you need to be able to do it every day or at least four to five times a week. It's all about being ready for duck season so when our clients get here they can see some top notch hunting dogs. And who's this stud right here? Uh, this is my dog Zink. He's about four year old. Hunt and Retriever Champion. Uh, he's a great duck dog, one of the best I've had. He picked up 1,308 birds Holy in uh, cow. 2016 17 season. So, how do you get a great dog like this one? Well, you know, here at Honey Break, we believe that you really need to start out with a good pedigree, a good bloodline, a dog that wants to do it, that's got trainability, and that's the first step. And then I'd say the second step is you got to put the time into it, the reputation, and have the knowledge or have the, a mentor. And nowadays there's so much stuff that you can learn online from videos, from books, and but we think it's mostly experience they get here in Honey Break of picking up, you know, in one season, a thousand to fifteen hundred birds. It's, and some people don't pick up that many birds in their dog's career. Mm -hmm. But to get that dog to that level, it's just showing them the whole waterfowl world and having the time, the property, the place, and lots of repetition, as I say. A dog can only be as good as the time you put into it, the property you got to train on, and the experience you can give it. What's one of the number one things that you try to remind people to do when they're training their dogs? Uh, this is art and a science in a way, but it's uh, it's a marathon, it's not a sprint. If you don't have time to do it yourself, find a good trainer that can do it for you. Thank you, Jared, for your time, and thank you, Zink, so much for your time. From Honey Break Lodge, I'm Abby Casey. Okay. Zink! Ah! <laughs> it's soaking wet. It takes a special breed to work in the mine. I'm sure I'll be all right. I hope. Be sure to check out Rated Red's new documentary, Black Rock Blues, out now on Rated Red's YouTube channel.